Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome. Uh, you're about to notice right now that um, I have slightly more stars. I mean slightly, I mean like five. But, uh, but yeah, I have a lot more stars than I did before. And yeah, you can tell by me completing all these. And the reason is, is that I tried recording this and I got the video done. And but what happened was, is the file corrupted twice. And what I was doing was, was when I was done with the recording, I wouldn't close the one-touch video capture program. I would just yank the cord out like an idiot. So Windows would restart and the file would corrupt. And if you get a corrupt file, there's not really much you can do about it. Anyway, um, this is I am too hard to pronounce, and um, yeah, I'm just not even gonna try and pronounce that. And now we shall race to that flag. It's like P Peanutissimo. I, I don't know. Just some names aren't worth trying to figure out. Um. Anyway, it is a race to the finish flag, and only one can try. By the way, the current record is 1682. Yeah, that's the record from before. And we're gonna try and beat that. So let's go. Um, as you can see, he goes pretty fast, but we are faster. 1545. That is the current record for me. <coughs> That's pretty good. Yes, I am pretty good. I have speed ever so slightly. You meet us again. Goodbye. And yeah, he just gives us this stupid thing. There's nothing really worth note about his uh, dialogue, so I'm not even gonna try and read it. Plus, I've read it like four times. So, yeah, we're just not even going to save and continue, because what are we going to save? The blue star that doesn't even count for anything? Really, now. Oh, uh, yeah, turtle shell, don't give a damn. Toad spinning, Mario do stupid thing, and me flipping. Let's just go back into the level. <laughs> okay, so next stage is going to be... What is it? Uh, no, no. This one, red coins and the coral beef. This isn't really a hard stage. Pretty easy. Nothing abnormally terrible about it. So yeah, for now, let's go. We boing. And yeah, notice that um, yeah, pretty much all the red coins are here. There's not much to talk about it. Some of the fish travel along. Some of the red coins travel along with the fish as if they're part of the herd. Anyway, th this shine t shouldn't take very long since I've already done it. But, um, a good trick here is to zoom out. So that way when... So that way you can see the red coins very easily and you can just go toward them. Once you have your sights on a red coin, just uh, get a closer view so that way you can see it. And then, yeah, just grab it. There's two red coins that, um, that, um, are, that follow fish. The other six are in the coral reef, as the shine name intends. And right now, it, that's four. That's pretty good so far. Five right here. So, yeah, most of this goes by pretty fast. If you know where the red coins are, which thankfully I do, um, yeah, you can do this pretty quickly. And I think it's kind of interesting how they move about like this. I don't know what they did. Maybe they, like, made the fish... Maybe they made, like, the red coin sprite behave like a fish. I don't know. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, it's basically, like... Basically, like, putting a red coin in there, but it acts like a fish. That's pretty much all I just said. Uh, I just made it sound all complicated. That's probably what they did, because it acts exactly like a fish. Maybe it's hypnotized or something. Okay, so let's grab the last red coin and get the shine. I'm actually making more progress than I did on the other two recording attempts. Last time it took about five minutes for me to get this shine. The other time we were on like ten minutes by the time I got to this shine. <clears throat> yeah, when, when you know where they are, it's pretty easy. Also, the first attempt, uh, the fish would like, the coin goes through the wall. So, yeah, that caused annoying problems, because it'll go into the ground for absolutely no reason. But once it goes in the ground, once it goes like through a wall or something, you can't even get it. So it's really stupid like that. <coughs> Keep coughing attack over here. 
But yeah, now we have it's Shadow Mario after him. Um, let's see, yeah. Top one says Gelato Beach, bottom one says I just said it. And as the name intends, obviously it's just like any normal seventh episode, Shadow Mario's right there. God, dude. Yeah, he gets sli slightly more annoying to, um, like, hit as time goes on. Remember, when all else fails, just do a scatter shot if, like, you're nowhere near him and you can't hit him rapidly by following him. Bam. Bam. Yeah, as you can see, it helps. Okay. Bam. Yeah, like, because sometimes he's just annoying as crap to hit. Ah, crap. Go, get, get over it. I wonder if, like, you can hit him in midair. Like, what would happen? I think he would probably just fall down at the nearest spot that he could. Anyway, that wasn't that hard. Dang it, they're saying over. It was over, like, two recording attempts ago, but sure, it's not over yet. Yeah, sorry guys, I'm not too happy about this. I recorded the first one on Sunday, and then I recorded this one. I recorded, um, last one on Monday, and I recorded, and I'm recording this one now. Um, which is Monday. Yeah, like, it shuts down. I just have to close the program and let the raw footage, uh, save, so that way that doesn't happen again. It's not really anything, it's not really the program's fault, it's just me being stupid. Although I will admit that my Audacity has a built-in recovery program, so that managed to recover it. But, the One Touch couldn't, but Audacity is an incredibly cool program, so... Yeah, it's a very trustworthy program. Like, honestly, if you guys want a Let's Play, and you want something that... A good program to start off with, uh, just get this one. There's really no excuse not to, it's free and it's perfect for everything you'd want to do. But, yeah. Anyways, yeah, the Watermelon Festival. You gotta get this watermelon. This watermelon's the biggest. What you wanna do is you wanna push this one over here. Yeah, please make sure it doesn't, like, break. It... Um... Whatchamacallit? I was gonna say... I was gonna say something. It breaks. Like, it explodes for no reason very easily. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. Crap, crap, crap. Oh, yes, no. Well, I guess that's a spot. Yeah, that's what I mean by explodes very easily. And I just got a coin. I don't want to try and do that. <coughs> Whatever. Alright, so now let's go this way. Again. Last time I got this in, like, the fourth take. The first time I did it, I actually got this in the second take. Just because this isn't really that hard if you have a direct path you're going to. Don't just go straight over there, usually it'll die because that's where the majority of the ducks are. If you go around, although it is more time consuming, it's slightly easier. Like, in the long run. Oh crap, that's not good. Woo! Okay. That was close. Yeah, let's just ignore that. Yeah, basically if those ducks touch it, uh, it explodes. They toss it up in the air and the fall breaks it. So, yeah, don't let that happen. Oh my god! No! You deck! 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 I don't know if it's possible to make it recover from uh, a fall, because usually it runs into something and then breaks, but I'm pretty sure that once it falls, you're pretty much done. <clears throat> so yeah, try not to let that happen. Anyway, third time's the charm, let's go. Well, yeah, once you get it out to the beach, you're pretty much in the clear. Oh, you've got to be crapping me. And where the... At least the watermelon's still up there. See? I think you can push it with the with Flood. Um, Alright, that works. Yeah, I don't know why. Yeah, I've been getting truancy calls. I don't really know why. I don't... I don't ditch or anything. But I work in the cafeteria, so sometimes, like... I'm late, and they mark me absent, even though they know I work in the cafeteria, so I end up being a little late, but I'll have to t I'll, I'll send them an email, my teacher's an email or something, but yeah, <clears throat> oh my god, oh my god, hey, what are you, 
jerk! Okay, I'm gonna cut to the successful attempt now. I don't want this to run on too long. Come on, this is supposed to be easy. Oh, you've gotta be crapping me. And you die! Getting so violent by pounding ducks into the ground. No words on that one. Keep going. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Don't explode or I'll kill your mother. God damn it! Oh, promise is a promise. Stop teleporting or I'll rape your mother or not just kill her, it will be very mean. Wait, stand back! Get away! Wait! Wait, wait, wait! No! Oh my god! You, no, you don't, you douche! Whew! That went well. Okay, now all we gotta do is. What the hell? Where did you come from? Where'd you come from? Where did you. Ah! My god! Bam! Crap! That was ridiculous. Ah! He's back up. Which means the, set, the other duck should be here next. Running, 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 running! Where'd it go? Holy crap. Okay. Ah, oh, shut up, you stupid pinch. I'm not in the mood. You have any idea how many ducks I had in danger by doing this? <clears throat> oh my god. Okay. One time I came here and the thing fell in the water and it exploded. Another time. Another time. Well, like, not in the recording, but like, bad memories of the stage. Um, it exploded while I was, run while I was pushing it. And another time I rushed and yeah, I fell in the water twice. Yes! I made it! <coughs> yes! Yes indeed, you feed the meat. <coughs> <coughs> so um yeah, we got the shine. Finally. Can't say much about that. That was pretty annoying. Ironically, if you would ask most people, um, this would probably be their fondest memory of this level. If you were to say, oh, do you remember that beach stage in Super Mario Sunshine? They'd be like, oh, the one with the watermelon. I mean, this level is just so awful. It's just like, the idea of it is so weird sometimes. I don't even understand it. But, whatever. Right now, we're going to go with one more star before we end this part. I don't know how much of that I'm going to cut. I had about four minutes of failure. And then, yeah, so we gotta go back to the first star. I don't know... I don't know the other secret stars. I think there's a couple of secret stars I might know, but yeah, there's a lot of secret stars in this stage. I don't fully know all of them. So, yeah, let's just get started. Okay. Oh, what the hell? Okay. This is new. Oh! Blue coin. Yeah, they hide blue coins in those. Please be aware that, um, I think one of them holds a sh uh, shine sprite. I don't know which one it is, though. I swear, for the life of me, I can't remember. But, whatever. We get in the castle. <clears throat> Let's start this red coin mission. Hopefully, I can do this before 20 minutes, because right now... Um, you guys are probably like on 16 minutes, or maybe 17, but I'm on 18 minutes or so. so, yeah, let's hopefully do this in one try. Last time I died in a couple stupid places, but that's all in the past. This is the future, and I'm not such an idiot. Alright. Right, so, we get third red coin. Okay. 
from this way. This is where red coin, the red coin hunts really start to become quite a bother in a way. So, because up to some level they can be hard. Like if you do, if you royally mess up, you will not make it in, in time. But right now I I sped through this. Holy crap! Anyway, okay. So also. Originally, when I played this game, I thought the shine was right there. Um, but yeah, they keep a one-up over there, because I thought, oh, hey, this is adjacent to it, or opposite side of it, sorry. I've been doing a lot of geometry lately. Uh, yeah, that's the opposite side of it, so that would make sense. But the one-up works just as well. At least they put something there. So, yeah, the final shine for now. Uh, yeah, next time we'll be actually collecting some yellow shines. Hoorah! Anyways, for the rest of today, we are going to say goodbye to Super Mario Sunshine. And, yeah, like I said, next time we'll be collecting yellow, uh, coin, coins, normal shines. Uh, please do not forget to, whatchamacallit, hold on. I'm gonna copy this file while I'm talking. But yeah, please do not, uh, Please do not. Please make some challenges for Pinta Park, the next stage. There will be tons of stuff, and I actually haven't seen that much evil stuff from you guys yet, so make up something totally crazy, and I'll do it. Not too crazy. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna regret that. Oh, wait, wait, no, no, no. Yeah, just go, go wild. Go wild and make me suffer. We all know you enjoy it. <laughs> yeah, goodbye.